Now, uh, Blake, is, is it hard for you to, to travel around and go to other places? It must be hard for you just travelling around L.A. Like, it uh, couldn't be anybody else. That's the right. thing. You're, it's only Blake Griffin. That's From the, a long way away. Yeah. That's, that's the, the thing. That's the only thing. Is like, we're so tall that people... You don't have to, like, recognise a face. You just recognise how tall somebody is. Yeah. But people always, like, because we play sports, people always, like, need, feel the need to, like, yell at you. So I'll be like... <laughs> <laughs> I was walking down the street and some guy was like, Hey, Blake! I, like, turn around and I'm like, uh, and he's like, Go Lakers! <laughs> 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 Which is like fine, but also it's like weird. It'd be like if somebody was like, James, go Jimmy. Yeah. <laughs> be like, All right, that's fine. You can watch, watch whatever you want. I don't care. Yeah. Yeah, I, well, Paul, what do people approach you about on the street? Well, I, I, I've worked really hard to kind of create this great uh, directing career. <laughs> like the, and it's always like, hey, Mr. Poole, or uh, hey, Stanley from Ski Patrol, because I was an actor of course. before that. Yes. So, yeah. <laughs> Why, thank you. Does anybody ever say to you, does, any, does anybody ever say to you, man, oh, I just can't believe nothing happened for you after, <laughs> after that. Where, where have you been, bro? I do get a lot of that. So what are you up to now? It's like, well, I'm hoping for Ski Patrol 2. We're yeah. really we're working on it. So. Uh, this well, time. It's coming through. It's coming through. Now, uh, Blake, you have a huge social media following. Um, millions and millions of fans all around the world. Do you ever get caught up? in what people are saying about you on the internet? You know, I try not to read, like, mentions on Twitter or, like, look through the hashtags and all that, but actually one time I was scrolling through, like, the, the popular page on Instagram, as everyone does, and I saw, like, I saw, like, the picture, and it was, like, a picture of myself. I was like, oh, like, let me see what that's about. And it was a video, and then the caption on the video was, like, Blake Griffin is the most un overrated player of all time. I was like, oh, that sucks. You know, I watched the video for a little bit. <laughs> and I was, like, I was like, you know what, let me get off this, but let me read the, like, the caption first. Yeah. And it was like, and he's ugly, too. <laughs> so, and then I just deleted Instagram, and I haven't gone since. <laughs> yeah. It's so. brutal, that. What, I, what do people get from it? That's what I don't quite understand. I can't believe you had a bad experience on the internet. I've always I had wonderful experiences. <laughs> I know. I know. But They're I, all lovely. Yeah. But I get... I get you, everyone has bad experiences on the internet, but the problem is when, you, uh, when you look like me is you also have bad experiences on the street. So <laughs> people will come up and they'll go, Oh, my God, you have to meet my brother, Chris. He looks exactly oh, no. the same as you. <laughs> and the guy comes out like... <laughs> <laughs> and you're like, and he goes, here you go, and I go, huh? <laughs> you and me. <laughs> <laughs> and then I just go in a car wash and, <laughs> and, 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 and eat my feelings. <laughs>